Hey guys, Mike here. Today I'm going to show you how to get a Facebook page access token that you can use for your project. First, you need to go to this link, the Facebook developers uh, section, then click the create app button. On the pop-up, you need to click the manage business integrations. Once clicked, you need to enter your, your app name, in this case, SK App 7 and then enter your contact email, so this is good for me. And then for the app purpose, you need to select yourself or your own business. After that, you can click the create app ID button. And then it will show a security check. You just need to click this checkbox. And then click the submit button. So let's wait for a few more seconds. Once you are redirected to this page, you need to click the settings and then basic menu you need to take note or you need to copy your app id and app secret so let me copy my app id here and then for the app secret just click the show button and enter your password so that it will show the app secret you need to copy it and paste it on your notepad because we will use the values later and then on the app domains you can enter sociablekit.com So let's do that. And then for the privacy policy text box, you can enter the privacy policy of Sociable Kit. After that, we can click the Save Changes button. The next thing we need to do is click this plus icon near the products label and then on the Facebook login option click setup once click you will sh you will see the settings menu under Facebook login you just need to click it and then on this field valid OAuth redirect URIs you just need to enter this link then click the save changes button And then after that, you need to log into your Sociable Kit account and then go to this link. This is where you will enter your app ID and app secret. So let's try that. Then if you have a if you have an existing app that was created before May 5th, 2020, you can check this box but since we are using a newly created app we, we don't need to, ch to check this we will click the login with Facebook button then you need to continue as yourself 
and then select all the Instagram business accounts that you will use with sociable kit but if you, you don't if you don't if you're not planning on using one you can just click the next button so for this example I just want to select these business accounts and then on the next page you will see all the Facebook pages that uh, you are an admin of so you need to select all the Facebook pages that uh, you are planning to use with sociable kit so for my example I need to use this one and then uh, for example this one as well and this so once selected you can click the next button so you will see an error message like this but you don't need to submit your app for review because uh, you will use your app only for yourself so we, we can ignore this message and then uh, for this uh, uh, question uh, we must ensure that yes has been selected okay once done we need to click the done done button and then click OK so after clicking OK you may now see the page access token that you can use for your project or for a system like sociable kit you can copy this and then put it where you need to use it okay that's it for now thanks for watching and please visit sociablekit.com and also subscribe to our youtube channel thank you